guys are here at, e, uh, at PAX and showing off the 360 version of Left 4 Dead. Tell us what the reception's been like so far. Oh, uh, it's been great. It's a great. It's, it's just a great opportunity to get to see like uh, having your demo release, but actually get to go to people's homes and watch them play and react to it. Um, we've had huge lines uh, all through the show so far, and it's been a great response to it. It's been fun. And once people get their hands on it, what are they saying once they walk away? Uh, I don't think I can say that on TV, um, but it's a lot of expletives, ex excited, scared, um, surprised us just how fast and hectic it is on the 360. Now talk a little bit about streamlining the game for the 360. What what enhancements or just how did you make sure that the game runs the smoothest? Well, really, what we've done is we always kind of, we always develop the PC and the 360 in tandem. So they, sit, they go together, and what we really did is it's your interface into the game that changed. And that's the controller. And so we've added um, aim assist to help the players with the fine-tuning of their ability to turn. Uh, we've also added a 180 flip button so that you can spin 180 degrees, uh, something easier to do with the mouse than it is the controller. And then we've also, um, this time around, um, have dedicated servers. And that, what that's going to do is that's going to make sure that 360 users get a good experience. Before, we'd have somebody with a dial-up connection for TF, and they'd say, I want to host 16 people. And it's like, well, you can't. Don't, you know? And they, and they would ignore our warnings in-game not to. And so what we've done here is, uh, with the dedicated servers, we're making sure more of our players will be able to have a good experience. You don't need to connect to a dedicated server. You can still host it by yourself. You can still play alone. You can still do a system connect in a dorm room. But if you want, you can have that experience as well online. Teamwork is everything. If you stray apart, you will die. We see we see guys like on the uh, 360 side of things. We see guys who are big gears players. They know how to play. They know they know the controls. They know how to shoot things. And they'll go stray off on their own. Think they can handle on their own, and they just simply won't. We also see the cool thing of is uh, players who aren't traditionally action-oriented players will come on and play, and you'll see them. You'll see the other guys yell. You know, we got to look out for this person. We got to help them. It's like a horror film where everybody's important, everybody's needed, so you need to take care of all your teammates. Are you guys making any announcements about the game here at PAX? Uh, it's just it's letting people see the 360 version for the first time. And just to show that the 360 version is the same frantic, paced action as if you have on the PC. And is there going to be a demo coming out on live before the game release? Uh, we'll be doing demos or betas both for the 360 and the PC before we haven't solidified our plans there. But it's like this, letting people play it, and the minute they play it, they get hooked. So, when is Left 4 Dead hitting the street? Uh, it'll be simultaneous PC and 360 release uh, November 20th.